Hey, so what's up guys, Pech here with Joytech. And if you've been looking for a protective case for your Huawei P20 Pro, this video is just for you because I have two units of the newly released Autobox Prefix series. If you know, I'm always a fan of Autobox. Of course, not every lineup, but most of the lineup, which includes the Symmetry Pursuit series, and those cases are my day-to-day -day cases. I'm still using them on my iPhone, on my S9 Plus, and those cases are really holding up well. So I believe that these two cases right here are no different, even though they are just TPU cases but they are reinforced as you know Autobox drop protection they're all connected together so these two cases right here will definitely get the job done so without further ado let me cue the intro and then we'll get into the unboxing of these two cases I'll put it on my phone and then we'll talk more about it so let's begin right now alright guys so we are back and before we begin the unboxing let me just go through the packaging and I'll show you what is printed on the box so in front here you get Autobox logo as usual and the series which is always in the center of the box which is the prefix series in this case and the bottom is state streamline protection on the bottom left you get your Autobox certified drop protection and you can see it's for the Huawei P20 Pros and uh, you can see this is actually a uh, transparent packaging which is kind of different from the, the ones which I've unboxed in the past which is actually a nice slide out box but this is a very generic box Okay, on the side, we can see Prefix branding right here. And on the back, other box certified drop protection again. Slim streamlined case delivers essential protection. This is just a basic TPU case, so don't expect all the bells and whistles of the Pursuit series or the Defender series. This just gives you the basic stuff. But this is Autobox first attempt at the Huawei case. So I believe there will be more to come in the future. So you can see drop protection, ultra slim one piece design and uh, shot absorbing inner core. So as usual, all the shot absorbing materials are uh, in this case and as well as the design as well so the same thing goes with the p20 case so the box malaysia has actually given me both units so i want to give a big shout out to them for actually giving me two units to actually show you guys so some of you may be rocking the huawei p20 but i for one am rocking the p20 pro so that's what we have right here i will still be showing you the p20 case after i install the p20 pro one so let's open this box and see what it comes with so this is my first time opening so I've actually never opened this before. Oh no, the case is actually sticking to the box. Okay, so upon opening the case, you get the case itself in this nice plastic mold right here to actually hold the case in place. So as you can see, it's just a very normal TPU case. So taking a look at the other contents of the box, we actually get Prefix series. So you can see what their CSR activity is all about. So inspiring kids to change the world. So that's about it. And then there is Autobox warranty. So these are the terms and conditions which we normally don't read. Okay, let's put everything else to the side and take a look at the case itself. So on close inspection, you can see there's actually a ripped pattern on the inside of the case. You can see the cutouts right here for your mic, your speaker, your USB-C. So let's just snap it on the phone. So right now I actually have the official Huawei silicone case. So I'll be taking that and putting that to the side. So you can see there's pristine condition right here. So I've always used the case since the beginning. Let's, so let's snap on this case and see how it fits. So you can see it snaps on pretty easily. Just like that. And also if you take a closer look, there's actually a dot matrix pattern. I'm not sure whether the camera is picking up those dot matrix at the back. You can see it's slightly forked up because of the dot matrix pattern. That actually helps in preventing watermarks and rainbowing effects because you know this is a glass back phone and glass back phones and TPU cases don't really work well together unless they actually do this sort of a dot matrix design. But of course it does take away from the clarity of the case. So overall it's not a deal breaker. I don't mind it. I'd rather have that than watermarks on the back of my phone. So let's take a close look at the cutout. On the right side, we have the volume rockers which are Easy to press, not the easiest, but um, not as easy as the official case, of course, but still pretty easy to press. And also your lock button. Okay, on the top, we actually have cutouts for your IR blaster as well as your secondary noise cancellation microphone. Okay, on the left side, we have Autobox branding right here. You can see it speaking up. Okay, and on the bottom, that's where we have our precise cutouts for USB-C port, our microphone, as well as our speaker port. So, okay, taking a look at the back, we actually have a generous cutout for the triple camera, which is the star of the show for the Huawei P20 Pro. Okay, so coming back, we actually have Autobox branding 
at the bottom. So on the corners, you can actually see we have this red design all around the phone. This helps in drop protection in case you do drop it. But of course, every case has its limits. You can't go around throwing your phone just because it's in auto box case. I do not approve of that. But if you do accidentally drop your phone, for example, if you put it on your lap and you get out of the car, and those, yes, it will protect those general drops. Sometimes we forget that we actually have our phones with us, not in our pockets, but on our laps. Yeah, this will help in general day-to-day -day abuse. Let's take a look at the P20 case as well. So since they've given to us, I'm, I want to show it to you guys. Okay, so the packaging is the same affair. Everything's the same, nothing special. So you can see the design is also the same. But of course, this is to accommodate the dual camera instead of the triple camera. You can see the cutout is slightly smaller. Take a look, compare these two. You can see that the camera cutout is a lot smaller right here. This case is basically not your average TPU case, but at the same time, it's not too bulky compared to the other cases which I reviewed in the past. The symmetry is not too bulky as well, but this is really slim, slightly slimmer than the symmetry case. So that's a good thing, definitely. But of course, it doesn't sacrifice drop protection as well. So I'll be bringing this phone actually to my Japan trip, which I'll be going in another one or two weeks. So I'll be taking this phone along with me. So do stay tuned to my Instagram profile. I'll be posting my Japan trip pictures. I'll also be doing some uh, vlog style video. I'm going there, so do stay tuned for that. Okay, so that's about it for this video. A big thanks to Autobox Malaysia for actually hooking me up with two of these cases to actually give my unbiased review. So I think if you're looking for a protective case other than the official Huawei case, this is your best bet. You can't find another case which has this amount of drop protection and gives you the peace of mind. You know, there's a lot of other China brands which I've used. I have it with me actually. And those are pretty flawed. So that wraps up our video today. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Okay, so do let me know what you guys want to see in the next video. And subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. I will greatly appreciate that. If you want to buy this case, I'll link it in the description below as well. So they have it for the P20 and the P20 Pro. So you can see how this case looks. It's not the prettiest case, but if you're looking for drop protection, for peace of mind, this case will definitely get you that. Okay, so that's all. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you guys in the next video.